Let's get to work. This game, unbeknownst to players, has so much to do with like book shit. Like when I read the books and I get to a part, I'm like, wow, this is in the game. Like uh, the druids, you just think, oh yeah, there's druids. But there's a whole chapter dedicated to druids in the books. Like there are a whole like major faction in the in the book that you don't really think about. But then they added it to the game here. Like yeah, there's druids. You don't see them in the other games, but they're in this game because we have to have druid. Just a thought. And then like the um, there's a there's like the, the, I don't think they call them the Order of the Flaming Throat uh, Rose, but they do call them the Order of the Rose or whatever. I don't know if there's an actual flame in there, but whatever. There's like there's basically it basically the Order of the Flaming Rose is in the book, and like they heavily are like yo there's a rose. I think it's actually a white rose, not a red rose, but I think they changed that for the game. And they're like yo the rose people are in the in this book. So they added it to the game. The Squire Tell, something they also added to the game. I don't know, it's just like, they basically wanted to please the readers so much in this game. I got a mistletoe. You know what? And well, I mean, I, I started playing the games before I started reading the books. Like always, like every every single series. And there's a mini series I want to start involving, like what you should do before playing a game. And then, like The Witcher is like, well, clearly you just have to read all the books, <laughs> which is kind of like Odd place. pointless. Looks to like make these giants for froze mid-motion. Must have been some time ago. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. Like The Witcher is like clearly you just have to read the books before you play the games if you want to know like the world of The Witcher because. The books came out first in chronological order. The books were first always, even if like the stories count account to like time unknown. Like some parts, like you just hear stories of Geralt doing something, and you don't know when he's doing it. It's just something he's doing. There they are, Yaren Bolt. Who are you? Geralt the Witcher, a friend. And we'll see. And you? Yaren, I speak for the Lumberjacks. Can we talk? Speak. Any jobs for a Witcher? Yep. Despite the danger, the beasts leave us alone. So nothing? Perhaps. I'm listening. But the Begatic plant should be blooming. I understand it. The drug it makes is... Collect some blossoms and I wade through. You don't know what beggar tip look. Okay. Great. Beggar tip blossoms. I'll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna be assholes and get some. Get some uh, drugs for people. However, I think beggar ticks are pretty good with. Are pretty good for um, potions. I think they give. Hmm. What did they give? <laughs> I'm trying to remember what they give, cause like, there's like herb, herb or whatever that gives like purple, celadine gives, gives green, um, white myrtle gives blue, light blue, not dark blue. So I don't remember. I, herb, um, beggar tick might give uh, red, which actually I don't know if there's red. No orange then, which we don't really have. My hearty. Oh right, I'm going the exact wrong way to pick it that way. Oh, let's go check out what's going on. Are you drowned dead? I'm ready to kill you. Remember when a drowned dead was a mini boss in the first chapter? Now they're just a common enemy that you just slaughter instantly. We need eight drowned dead, I'm pretty sure, for the uh, for a quest. I thought I was down here. Guess I didn't 
do it properly. Alright, let's run across the field. Oh no! Got that though. We're looking for orange. Oh. Bye. No girl, no. Ah. Oh, man, it doesn't have anything to skin. What's the point? Alright, you know, I'm just getting out of here. There's too many enemies. I'm trying to do shit, and drowners are just fucking with my day. Like, I don't need to fight regular drowners. They don't give that much XP anymore. They might. I haven't been paying attention to the XP bar, but I honestly don't want to fight them anymore. It's a waste of time. They don't give you as much money. Or credit. Those are all the things I care about. Like, there they are, the bigger thing. Alright, time to kite. Oh shit, there's Al Ghouls here. <laughs> Damn. This is most of Witcher 2. You're trying to do one quest by collecting this item. But monsters appear, so you have to kill them. So then you kill them, and then you used to go to collect things, and then more monsters. Which, to be fair, if you lived in the Witcher's world, like tower collapsed on its own. I wouldn't doubt I that this, this would happen. Like you, you try to go collect some herbs, and then monsters appear. Because <laughs> apparently monsters are everywhere, and that's why they made Witchers. So I'll give this game that. At least it feels. Zephira and Obelisk merged. I need to make more small. The fuck? Oh. That, I don't even... Oh! I thought it said... Honestly thought it said Drowner, and I was like... Really? Just one Drowner? Like... Out of all the things... A Drowner... That I honestly don't give a shit about. I didn't want to make things. I still have loot in the big one. I thought that was loot. But no, it's a fire. Is that it? Gotta go to get those bigger kicks, but let's make some potions. And level up. Now we're even more strong. Follow. Mm. 
Wait, what the? Oh. What the hell? Why am I stun locked? What? Fuck off! How many, uh, let's check our quest. Alright. So I need three root sacks. I didn't know I need root sacks. I need their spores, but it's actually root sacks. Ten pelts. Ten tongues. I thought it was eight. Shit. I was like near eight. way to fight monsters, kite them, then get them all together so you can just start swinging your sword around like an idiot. Is that it? No, are you fucking... I just want to grab the Baker Tick, okay? It has Rubuto. Not what we need, though. Not what we need at all. I don't remember what gives us Vermilion or whatever the hell it's pronounced. Because I need that. Must construct small pylon. I don't remember what game it was, but there was a game where you could construct <laughs> speed potions, and I would just drink those so I'd run even more fast. <laughs> just so I could get to places faster. And I don't remember what it. I think it was Far Cry 3, or Far Cry 4. No, I think it was 3. I don't know if there was in 4, but I know it was definitely in 3. And I just struck a bunch of speed potions, because all it took was, uh, like, two, 2 blue and a green or something like that. And I would just construct speed potions, and that's all I would have on the side of my healing potions. And you just... I just run everywhere, because, like, finding a car took too long for me, so I was just like, you know what? Let me grab this and let's go. And I went vroom vroom beep beep super fast. Fighting any form of canine that resembles a dog is always... I don't know, just like the sound they make. I I don't want to fight them, but they're trying to eat. Ah, there he is. There's the asshole himself.
Yeah. Welcome to the Druid's Grove, Traveler. Greetings. Marvelous place. I come here when I need to think, and the peacefulness helps clear my mind. Even a Witcher is welcome here. One more word about my accepting my otherness and finding the home I never had and I'll cry like a baby. Sarcasm only serves to expose your inhibitions. Ooh, an elven psychoanalyst. I spent decades among humans. I find your kind as complicated as the schematics of a flail. Decades? <laughs> Live that long among humans, you're bound to become more like them than you ever wanted to be. Are you speaking from experience, Monster Slayer? A sharp wit. I'm Geralt. My name's Yaven. Let's talk. Yes. I'm looking for Witcher's work. Then I'll ask you a favor. I need a letter delivered to Vizima, where I'm not welcome. As a Witcher, you should find little difficulty tending to monsters on the way and avoiding trouble with the guards at the city gates. Who's the letter to? I'd be obliged if you could deliver it to Bivaldi, a dwarf living in town, and then return his reply to me. I'll do it. I'm going to Vizima anyway. Thank you. The thing is, there's a character right over there. She's a dryad. She's also naked. And I don't know if I'll get in trouble for that. <laughs> 